dynamic and one that we haven't seen before from Gluttony on the big stage. We've seen this cloud plenty of times locally, yeah. never at an international tournament. And I think we're going to get straight into game one with that cloud coming out immediately. So here we already see an early platform camp here by Gluttony. And look at the patience of that cloud. Once he does get that one hit when Ixis tries to contend with the platform camping, he pushes it all the way to the maximum. 54%, you were talking about all the, the percent he could get, and that's that's already a big lead. For sure. We were talking again, well, uh, there, are, there have been so many Sonics, you, we, we don't need to remind you how a lead against Sonic or for Sonic changes the dynamic of the exactly. game. Exactly. So much, but uh, I mean, in these kind of matchups, this is a big deal. We gotta remind you as well that limit is a thing, so it basically means that, oh, and that upper, he doesn't care about limit, he doesn't care about the lead, he's just going in. And Ixus is looking... Uh, He's looking pretty bad in this matchup right now. Look at this, 120 mm. on Ixus. And Gluttony has hardly been touched. Ixus messing up his, his tag that doesn't happen often. Oh, and where, where's the smirk now? Where's where smirk is that smirk now? now? Exactly. Where's the smirk now, Ixus? And, and I mean, Gluttony is sitting on limit as well. This is looking extremely strong. He's even utilizing the platforms. And just like against Little Mac, uh, he's, he's only going in on his own terms. And his own terms are definitely looking strong right now. Look at all that limit. Look at all those hitboxes that Cloud can throw out relatively freely versus Sonic. And Gluttony is putting on so much pressure on Ixus right now. Mm, and that forward tilt putting Ixis off stage is no. Gluttony isn't able to actually uh, oh, get where did anything go? that. I have no idea. I have no. Maybe he used the RP just to uh, exactly. grab the edge. Exactly. That's not probably the edge, it. Yeah. So no limit for Gluttony, but he's still looking to swing that forward air. Is going to be so laughing. Oh, and, and that footstool. footstool is not going to quite be it. But Gluttony, he has to be close to limit already. Mm. Well, Ixis finally. Finding a way to put Gluttony off stage, but Gluttony having none of it, exactly. coming back on stage with that down air dash and the dash attack, attack. on the landing. Not He's a lot of options that Sonic has. Sonic has one of the worst disadvantage state out of all the top tiers, but one of the best confirms. Look at that spin dash into forward air, gonna close out that stock. So very clean play by Aces and oh, what's going on there? He's going right on the top platform. Gluttony was trying to camp, yeah. grabbing Gluttony out of it with all the confidence in the world, telling that him, is, yeah, yeah, this is not gonna work. That's definitely me. one of Aces or uh, one of Sonic's best mix-ups against platform campers is he can. Do an auto cancel up air, which is going to be plus on block, and then you're going to have to hard guess whether he's going to grab yeah, you or yeah, not. Yeah, makes sense, makes sense. So he went directly for the grab, knowing that Gluttony was either. Oh, oh, very oh. nice take, but wow. that back air. Oh, Jesus. The tech read using the runoff back air from the platform. Gluttony, he is such a strong and aggressive player right now using that cloud, and that's something that he's never been able to utilize to its maximum potential with Wario, because while Wario is a fast character in the air, he does not have the tools to be aggressive because of his small limbs. Well, he has nothing. On the other hand, Cloud does have more air speed than Wario with bigger hitboxes that do more damage and confirm into stronger combos. And Gluttony, he's showing how much of a beast he can be when he does pick up a good character. Oh, yes, he can. And that's something interesting as well, because uh, Cloud might be one of the best characters in the game, but For sure. he's not... A character we usually see at top level playing aggressive. Like you usually, yeah. you usually don't get that much from playing aggressive. You just wall out to your opponent and punish him from well, from whenever you get an advantage state. But Gluttony having none of that playstyle. He's you know he's an aggressive player and he's gonna take his own playstyle, put it on the table with one of the best characters in the game and, and that push is, it. Yeah, I mean that's definitely Gluttony's claim to fame. The way he views aggressive interactions in this game is just also very unique compared to... Oh, did, th <laughs> did they? I think the spring actually yeah. hit him, yeah. and that's top, what gimped him. Top-level EU play right there, top boys. Top-level EU play, both oh. these characters blo uh, falling into the blast zone, and we're going to have an even game here on Battlefield in game two. All right, that upper taking him out. Side B, this. nice punish. That's going to be 19% barely legal right there. Cloud, still a lot of pressure. Once again, going to hit a limit cross, or normal cross slash, and going to build a lot of limit with that because of the high damage that it puts out. Back air, X is very, doing very well, pushing him off stage with Gluttony. He's just going to recover every single time using that extreme air speed that Cloud does have, especially in limit. Gluttony now Ooh. holding the center stage, and yeah, that's slap. Ixus actually called out the spotters with the forward smash a little bit off on the execution bow, and Gluttony not getting much of a punish just out of it. Just missed time, but I am so very impressed from uh, Ixus actually being able to make such a big guesses at such a high speed of gameplay as well. Exactly. The, everything is going so fast, like the interactions are going so, uh, so quick, and he still 
takes the time to actually sit back and say, yeah, I can actually smash there. Yep, a nice nair to, uh, to limit cross slash, barely gonna whiff there on Ixus. Very nice DI coming out from Ixus, knowing about that kill setup and avoiding it very well. All right, and now Ixus is back to his classic game, just uh, trying to... Well, that's the thing. He's back to the classic game. He's just trying to punish every approach with that sub B uh, invincibility. But whenever um, Glutton recognizes the situation, he charges limits. Exactly. He, he charges does limits and that he does not the play commit no, at all. He doesn't need to. And that's one of those so things much. that you need to be good at when you're playing aggressively. You need to know when you're over committing and you need to make sure that you don't make that mistake. Mm, and that back here almost killing Ixis already, but he will make it back. Now Gluttony has no limits, but pretty much everything uh, he will throw at Ixis will take the stock though. And it's so impressive how well Ixis has adapted between this and game one. After game one was so rough on him, this is looking like a last hit game already. And then Neutral are putting Ixis off stage. Now Gluttony with the limits for Electra, but yeah. Ixis not letting him try to think, actually jumping back with a four there, back in the game, just like that. And I want to see, I want to see Gluttony go for an up out of shield. That's probably like the safest kill option he has right now, but instead he just goes for the limit in neutral. Definitely not a good call, and Ixis is going to make the most out of that, trying to get that kill, but Gluttony, he stays on top of Sonic, not giving Sonic time to set his neutral. He's giving him nothing. Ixis recognizes the situation. Uh, he could have actually tried to sneak in something, but he could, he saw that Opper might have actually touched him. He went for the others Ooh. right away. And that back throw might be something big. Not Definitely not Ooh. killing, but putting Gluttony in a very bad spot. What is Ixis about to do? Trying to let trap him, try to he read the jump. He read the jump, but he was off on the timing. Very, very unfortunate for Ixis. But Gluttony definitely going to oh. make the most out of that. Bouncing him like a pinball. And I mean, Sonic is used to that. The pinball stages are <laughs> all over the Sonic games, oh, right? And in yeah, that case, yeah, yeah. not too happy about it. And that's one of those things that's so important about this matchup is not only does Cloud wreck more damage than Sonic, yeah. he also has way more kill options than Sonic does, oh, especially thing, yeah. when uh, Cloud gets a blue blur of his own. Yeah, yeah well, he might be actually used to being the pinball, but that sure hurts. Like when you get yeah. actually uh, just crushed on stage and bounce back and actually die on Battlefield just show how strong Cloud is as a character. Yep, and just sure. that basically everything uh, is gonna is, is gonna be able to kill at some point. Yep, for sure. And while that was a strong finisher from Gluttony, yeah, that was still a very close game. Oh, and it was. if this trend continues from the dominance showing in game one to the nearly nearly even game, I want I want to call it even, but in the end Gluttony won, right? That yeah. even showing from yeah, Gluttony. Yeah, yeah. If that keeps going on, Ixis is gonna win the next game. Yeah, but just something that I'm, I'm curious about is that we, we didn't play. They didn't play first stock. Exactly. That's they true. didn't play first stock, and, and it's something Ixis seems to have uh, mo uh, the most trouble with is killing Gluttony. Like right. Gluttony is so good so at defensive if he play. Had, uh, had had another scenario in which they would both be a kill percent. Yeah. Maybe Gluttony would have had more of a lead in the long term. Is what you're exactly. saying. Exactly. Yeah, yeah. That's okay. A that's interesting. That's actually a very good observation. I think it's going to come into play right here on game three, going back to Battlefield because both these players love that stage. However, I do think this is uh, arguably Cloud's best stage because that platform is going to give him a lot of kill confirms. And on top of that. Be when he's off stage, he can use his airspeed to land on those platforms rather than go to the ledge. A lot of options for Cloud oh, here. Oh, that board is gonna connect. All no right. kill because it is Sonic. And once and again, another. all right, no, no other. Oh God, he's just swinging with that. He's forwarder. swinging, and that's limit on deck. That's a big deal for Gluttony here. Look at this. Look at this pressure that Gluttony is putting out, and once again blows his limit way too early. Not gonna be a good look for Gluttony, however he still has that lead, but Ixis is slowly inching his way back into the game. Look at that, 66% in just a few interactions. Ixis is looking to make this happen on game three. Yeah, Ixis just going back uh, slowly into that game, but now Gluttony has his limit, and we were talking about kill power, Ooh. and that dash attack will not take it. Battlefield definitely helping Ixis there, helping him survive that dash attack. Such a strong option, especially with Rage, Ooh. and the mix-up limit on landing immediately. Very strong by Gluttony, and he immediately gets to charge a good portion of his limit back because uh, Ixis does have to respawn there. We were talking about kill power Ooh, and that limit. Oh, no, no jump, but still no dice. Oh, did you see the weave? Yeah, the yeah, air yeah, speed yeah, yeah. by Glutiny, extremely well done by Glutiny right there. And Ixus all over him, not gonna get the kill quite yet, though. As you mentioned, Sonic does have a little bit of an issue killing, especially versus a character like Cloud, who's not only heavy, but fast and so disjointed as well. 
All right, Ixis, what do you have? I feel like Ixis is still like speeding up his game. That's the usual thing. When when he starts losing, you see Ixis actually go faster yeah. and faster on him. Oh, oh, what is, is that? that it no, on holy a spike and here, leaving nothing left alive in his wake. Jesus Christ. That was impeccable. That was awesome. He, he realized.